Hi Panasonic fans, my name is Stephanie Aci and now I'm reporting from one of Indonesia's remote island Karimun Jawa. On this isolated island, they doesn't have stable electricity. So, during daytime, you can see there's no electricity at daytime. The small plant only runs by 12 hours a day. So that's why people here only can use electricity during night time. Tidak adanya listrik di sekolah kami, sehingga uh, kami belum bisa menggunakan media-media yang sudah ada seperti proyektor, uh, komputer, dan juga laptop. Uh, untuk sebagai penunjang belajar anak di kelas, karena tidak adanya listrik, maka kegiatan belajar mengajar tidak bisa berlangsung dengan maksimal. Harapan kami ada listrik yang masuk ke sekolah kami. To help solve these issues, Panasonic proposed the power supply container as a standalone photovoltaic power package, which are now being used by the Japanese embassy for its ODA activities in Indonesia. Power supply container is one of the off-grid power generation systems for the Indonesian market. This system is combined for the PV and batteries. And next future, I hope I would like to create a new demand for the, such a kind of the area and expand another country and make happy for all of the children. Sehingga anak-anak bisa mengikuti belajar dengan senang dan nyaman dan anak juga bisa menyerap pelajaran yang disampaikan oleh guru. Saya bisa menulis bagus karena ada lampu. Lagar bagus! Container Panasonic is a very good breakthrough for providing electricity in a very remote area, especially for the school, because you can provide wide range of technology that can improve the capability and the capacity of the students to study. Thank you. Panasonic will continue to develop solutions that will help to provide the necessary infrastructure to areas without access to electricity, so it can help enrich the life of many people around the world. Bye-bye! For more news, visit Panasonic News Portal at news.panasonic.net Panasonic